Hello and welcome to this video. In this video I want to demonstrate how to set up NVDA to work on a desktop PC as opposed to a laptop. NVDA is a free screen reader. A screen reader is a great piece of software that gives computers, smartphones and tab tablets a voice in order to help people who have a visual impairment or who are blind access these devices more independently. I have created other videos about the screen reader NVDA and I have grouped them together in a playlist which I will link with which I will link to below. As I said in this video I will show you how to set up NVDA to work with either your desktop PC or your laptop. Now the reason why this is important is because of the differences between the layout of a keyboard on a desktop PC and the layout of a keyboard on a laptop. There are quite a few differences between the two and these differences are important when you are using NVDA because it relies so heavily on being controlled by the keyboard. NVDA needs to know if we are using it on a desktop PC or a laptop so that you can use it as flawlessly as possible. The good news is, is that this setup will take you less than a minute. So let's dive right in and start NVDA. Your copy might start as soon as you log on to your PC but mine is set to start manually. So to start mine I press the Windows key and, and the D key to focus on the desktop. Then I press the N key and the Enter key. Folder view list NVDA 305 with NVDA, start, NVDA started, I press the NVDA key, and mine is the insert key, and the N key together. NVDA menu. The NVDA menu is displayed. I then press P for preferences, General settings. And, and K to get into the keyboard, keyboard settings. settings dialog. Keyboard layout. Combo box laptop collapsed alt plus K. Now just use your down arrow to toggle between either the laptop keyboard setting or the desktop keyboard setting. And once you have selected the right one, desktop, laptop, press enter. Your copy of NVDA is configured to work perfectly with your desktop PC or your laptop now. Screencast -O -Matic 2, 1. And there you have it, my quick and easy guide to setting up NVDA to work with different keyboards. If you have any questions or difficulties or want to join in the, in the discussion, please do so below. Do you use NVDA on a desktop PC or a laptop? Let me know. Thanks desktop. for watching.